Welcome everyone. I am back. Today is July the 21st, 2022. We are going to talk about AMD and how it is a short term breakout stock. Now, welcome everyone to my channel. This is HFN. I create price predictions. I make sure that we are positioned to win. This is how we are able to beat our competition is by being ahead of them. It's by predicting. So if you guys want to join me, welcome to the channel. I'm not here to pump stocks. I'm not here to give you any fear, any FUD, any FOMO. My job is to show you that this game is easy and it's not hard and it's not complex and it's not complicated. You don't have to hold stocks for 15 years just to grab some profitability. You don't. You just need to see where the market is going. Let me show you. You all appreciate my videos, my content. Hit the like button, share the video, also subscribe, tap that bell notification as well because I want you to be one of the first ones to know where prices are anticipated to go. Now, let's talk because you guys can see already in front of you, my expectation was for AMD to go down. Yes, it was. Now, this price prediction has been on the chart since June the 17th, June the 18th right now I want you all to see this because I'm not pulling your chain I want you all to see where the price in AMD grabbed support right, right before it started to go up so for us to see the market price in AMD come and grab support around $73.50 we're not surprised. I already had that horizontal line right here on the chart. Were you able to grab profitability there? Because I told you that that would be one of the price targets, right? That's 10%. Did you do that? See, when we create these videos, these price predictions, we give you time price targets as to where we're looking for price to go because we understood that the price could stand up there, meaning it will stop going down. Now imagine if you were to take the profitability and you bought the market at the same time. Because now you will be up in the play 22%. You see this, right? This is how this game is played. You know when to get in, you know when to get out. Now, AMD is short term bullish. Yeah. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and get rid of this price prediction because if you were to get out the market now, you're down 9.63%, which is why I give you all price targets. Okay, now check this out. Here we are. Okay, this is the overall shape of the market. This is what the market has determined as being market efficient, meaning this is what the market has determined to be the price of what AMD should be. And we're looking at it right now. We're in a downtrend. Now we are closely approaching that downtrend line, right? Could this move higher in AMD almost be over? Of course, let's not be blinded. We all can see that price in AMD has been unable on multiple occasions to break outside of this downtrend line since November of last year. So as we are closely approaching this descending line, we need to consider and be real and say that price is anticipated to break down there we will understand we won't be scared we won't question because we already know what's up right now i want you all to see this here as well okay because my attention is being drawn right around here okay that is the location that i'm looking for AMD to find more sellers, right? And this is the bullseye that we are seeing right there. That is it. We have to keep our eyes open in AMD. Look at this on a three-day chart, okay? So we're looking at AMD on a three-day chart, right? And we got earnings coming up August the 2nd. This is where the price in AMD could be ready to go back down either up to or before this earnings release. Be prepared for that. Now, this last completed three-day price bar 
currently looks decent. It doesn't look bad. It looks actually pretty strong for us to say that yes, here in the market in AMD, the market is primed to continue to go up. I mean, it's been a fantastic run. Look at these two-day price bars right here. The last couple of two-day price bars, price has just gone up, right? So now you might be thinking, I need to jump on board AMD right now, right? You might be thinking that. Here it is on the weekly. So now, what do I think? I think the market could go up another five, six percent. It might try to top out around a hundred, and that would be around twelve percent. Highly unlikely. I don't see that really occurring, uh, given the current environment that we're noticing across the world. But I think the market is going to try to come around ninety-five. Okay. Now, to me, that wouldn't be worth it. I mean, because like I said, it's only what five, six percent. It may be worth it for you for the market to go up six and a quarter percent, but that's short term. Okay, let's keep it real. This is this is a short term move higher because the three month chart, right? The three month chart is still reflecting to us weakness right here. Okay, so from this time frame, I'm still looking for the price in AMD to go down. This time frame, I'm definitely looking for the market here in AMD to go down, right? Because of that six months price bar right there. So let's try to put everything into context. Short term, yes, market in AMD could run up to around $94, $95 back up here towards this descending line right here okay and i would expect that to occur hit this area of downtrend line this downtrend line towards this earnings okay i'm just here to give you all the play as to what i'm anticipating now like i said you can actually play that into the market if you want but i'm not going to put on a price prediction i am expecting it to go up though but only that high Okay, to like $94, $95, give or take. It might even fall a little bit lower to like 92 I can see that there too. But yeah, let me go ahead and put this on the chart. I just wanted to come in and show you all that from a short-term basis, um, the market here in AMD is doing a breakout. Like this is a small move higher in price. The price has not gone down in AMD since July the 13th. Now, I think we're about to embark on a point to where the sellers are going to push back down the price. So I just want to put you all on guard. I just want to give you all a heads up that, yes, this market here in AMD is short term bullish. But in the long term, the three months, six months chart, this chart is still massively weak. OK, now I won't change this idea until we see the market in AMD break outside of this. I want to see the market successfully break outside of this range because if so then we understand that the market is not that bearish so let's wait and see now you don't have to wait and see you have your own mind so i want you all to tell me real quick what is your expectations in amd are we going to go up go to go down what are you expecting in the short term now short term is defined to me as over the next couple of weeks like three weeks what is your expectation on the long term long term defined to me is on a monthly basis two months three months six months not six years okay and just tell me where you think the market is headed let me know you before i go you all can see that i got these arrows here right now price in amd has already filled this gap right it already took out this first gap see that we already came and filled this first gap in AMD back there on July the 4th July the 5th so we could get rid of this arrow successfully did that we got one more arrow to fill or one more gap that needs to be filled in AMD 
So let's not get complacent. This is just a placeholder to temporarily hold price. Don't say you haven't been warned. I'm done. Make sure you maintain the profitability. And as I continue to see the market go up and I see the rejection come in on that descending line, I'll come back in and do another price prediction. Or even if I see the market break outside of this descending line to begin to go up, I'll come back in and do another price prediction. But my anticipation is that the market's going to fall short around $94, $95. And then we'll begin the descension back down. All right. Questions, comments, let me know. Make sure you maintain profitability. And as always, trade different.